Hey guys, it's me, Mopar Matt, back at it again. Uh, round two. Ooh, excuse me. <clears throat> I remember saying quite quite a while ago. I think it was my second or third video from Gogo's house that when I first started getting the cool classics that um, <clears throat> I really liked them and I would definitely um, start collecting the set well <clears throat> I'm, I was dead serious about that because on top of I think it was yeah I have uh, eight there on the wall already and the other three that I still have to put on the wall, I have five more. Uh, 67 Shelby GT500. Well, ah! Look at that beautiful light blue Spectra Frost. Beautiful, beautiful car. No, no tail lights on this, but oh well. I ain't gonna complain. They're beautiful cars. Um, 1970 Ford Mustang Mach 1. Voila! Check that out. Look at that insane burnt orange color. Oh man, it's just amazing how they do this Spectra Frost. No tail lights on it. All right, we got close up of the hood detail, including the hood tack, right, right next to the uh, air. The air intake comes through the hood. You got the hood tack. Then, with opening hood, mind you, 1968 Mercury Cougar. Voila! <clears throat> Excuse me. Beautiful uh, light blue with some green on it. Once again, no special tail, no special tail light treatment or nothing like that. The roof treatment, and the hood does open on that one. Then I picked this one up just last night. Um. 52 Hudson Hornet. Voila! And yes, I'm not going to say that cliche line again. Don't worry. But it is gold. <laughs> not going to say the line again. Look at it. It's the same color. Love it. And of course, Top Shot. Then we have. The Blastius Moto Tricycle. Voila! Or trike motorcycle, excuse me. Tricycle. Where was I going to open that? Look at the details on top of this thing. That beautiful red color. Absolutely had to, had to get this because it was part of the set. And like I said, I'm getting the set. Okay, now that that's out of the way, um, I'll show these guys off next. Um, had to pick me up one of these. Um, I had the second one that I was going to crack in hand. I had it in my hand last night. But I put it down to get something else that I'm going to show you a little bit later on. But here's the first one I'm going to keep on the card for now. Howling Heat. Voila! I know it's just a regular mainline thing, but by now everybody knows the way I am. Unless I have two, I don't like to crack them. 
This way I have one I can at least somewhat keep factory appearing. Then I picked up two more of these bad boys. I'm not sure if there was a roll cage variation on this, but I still checked for the roll cage anyways. Um, <laughs> two more. Voila! Blue Nissan Skyline GTR 34s. Got two more of those bad boys. So if you want them, let me know. And here's one I finished. I finished this off, this variation set, finished it off last night. The Twin Mill 3s, both variations. Voila! Check that out. You got the, uh, got the checkerboard and that little dip behind the headers on the top one. And on the lower one, it's smooth, no checkerboard. So I've got that, that variation set. Noise. And until, like I just said, until I get a second of both of them, I ain't cracking these two. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> Was not expecting that. Um. And in case any of you out there are still having trouble finishing off your 2013 regular treasure hunt set, I found me another honey hole of sorts for the cute case bed to the blades. And I now have four more. None of them are wheel variations or not, not noticeable. That makes anyone special. But, um, I found, I did technically find five. But I'm cracking another one. Cause it's gonna be getting a nice little wheel swap. Now. Uh, remember I told you I had the Howlin' Heat number two in hand um, last night when I put it down so I could get something else. Well, uh, you guys might remember when I uh, when I cut open that orange um, Shelby Cobra. Um, well, this big time muscle set is, it's grown on me. And me and Chris found last night, we found a, a spot where if I had the money, I could have finished off all six of those. I could have bought the other five. But... Needless to say, it's all about the money. Um, so I am now up to four in the set. First one to add to the unopened set for this one in Wave 18 is the 69 Corvette ZL1. Voila! Check that the else. Beautiful red color, big blacked out wheels, stripe over the roof, of course tail lights and even the name Corvette on the back. Voila. And like I said, it's wave 18. Then we have the one that I first saw, and I'm definitely going to be getting a second though, because I want to, I want to cut one of, I want to cut one of these castings open. '69 Chevy Camaro. Voila! 
look at that beautiful pink. Absolutely beautiful green. Almost, almost like the original Fathom green, as GM called it back in the day. Just to show you how much I know my, my 69 Camaros. Of course, big old blower, gold uh, racing stripes, as, as could be expected. Tail lights, SS logo on the back. That's this logo on the front, supercharger. Let me see if I can get that a little better. Yeah, that's about the best you're gonna get it, guys. So yeah, I'm I'm gonna cut another I'm gonna cut the second one of these bad boys open. And last but not least, for the haul part of this video, considering I'm in the mood to do a, a mini cracking party here. So, uh, the last of the big time muscle um, castings. 70 Boss 429 Mustang. Yeah! Look at that beautifully deep blue color. Just, oh my gosh, this, this one was screaming at me. I don't know what it says on the back there, but of course you can see the tail lights, the stripes. See the front, big old, big old blower sticking through the hood, and the back it says "Big Time Muscle" on the rear license plate, and of course the top shot. Got to do that. So yeah guys, that's it for the haul part portion. Um now um they're all good cards, so here comes the mini cracking party. Like I told you I would do. Cracking another treasure hunt. Live. And of course, you guys have seen me crack one of these bad boys. So I don't really have to spend a whole lot of time showing that off. Then we have, like I said I would do, I'm going to do it live. Add this little beauty to my Zaymac collection. Oh wait, no, I have one of these in my open collection. Okay, looks like I'm going to customize this one. Definitely going to do a wheel swap on this. This deserves some real riders. That's right, I forgot to show gaming one open already. And then, like I showed you, those two uh, blue Nissan Skylines, I didn't have one open. Now I do. Check that beast out. Beautiful. Look at the flake in that in the paint. Oh my gosh, this thing is dope. To quote to uh directly quote James Sheer. Of course got the rear taillights GTR and Nissan logo. This thing is nuts. And some of y'all might cringe a little when I open this thing. Um, but I found me a second. Cool Classics Purple Passion. Um, and yeah, I don't crack many cool classics. But this Purple Passion, as soon as I got the first one, it was calling, it was calling to me. That is, and as soon as I found the second one, I'm cracking it. So, here we go. Ah! Look at that. 
up close personal outside of the box goes flames galore Of course, big lip on the wing, or the rear bumper, I should say. Ooh, look at that. This was worth the crap. Nice. And I know y'all have seen this before. Um, turns out it's a lot more common than I thought it was. So. If you don't want to see it opened, turn turn your eyes away now because it's it's happening. It's happening. Sick. Voila. All in this one. My first highly hauler and it's cracked. PJ, I hope I, I hope you like this one, uh TBAJ. Cause I do. And last but not least something else I found on the hall last night a second Wolverine yeah baby he's joining grave the, the uh, opened grave digger voila check that out Close and personal. Wolverine! In case you guys don't know, I'm a huge X Men fan. And like most fans, I'm an avid Wolverine fan. <sighs> Sorry. Of course, you got the claws there. And if you guys can bear with me for a minute, hmm, I can show you something else I have that's Wolverine related. If you guys are willing to wait, okay? I promise I'll make this short and sweet. Okay, guys, I'm back. Sorry for that. But trust me, it's worth it. Um, now picture yourself watching an X-Men movie. X-Men movie, whatever, however you want to pronounce it. And you see Wolverine getting ready for a fight. Yes, you're not imagining things. Movie size reproduction claws as part of my knife and sword collection. <laughs> I am Wolverine. I figured you guys would like that. Well yeah guys I'm gonna wrap it up. I'm hitting the 20 minute mark on this video. Um I hope you liked both the videos that I've died I did today. Um and let me know what you think about what what I showed in this video that I picked up or the 
cars that Chris had given me from his trip in Canada, Florida. So, this is Mopar Matt signing out. Peace!